<laughs> yeah, so Jenna, what do you think about Cedar Bridge School, man? Oh, it's a great school. We got great kids, you know. I mean, they were very attentive today. So, you know, I want to big up the kids at Cedar Bridge Academy. Yeah, and, uh, and the teachers too. Because and the they're teachers. Doing that, so they're doing a great job. Yeah, let's hear a shout out from the kids. Come on. How are you feeling, kids? I'm great. You great. feeling well? I'm very great, great, yes. Excellent. Glad Excellent. to have you guys there. And that's star, you know. Yeah, and that's I mean, there were a lot more, you know. Yeah. Many of them going to their different classes. But I just want to say it was a pleasure being here and it's an honor really talking to people and some students who were really listening. It's nice when you have an audience that people really are paying attention, you know, that's the greatest gift a speaker could ever have. <laughs> so I just want to you took quite a bit of your time today to spend time with the children and speak to them. Yeah. Give us a little quick wrap up of what you spoke to them about and why it's important to Well, you to I, I spoke to them, you know, that, you know they, not to take life for granted, you know, touch on very important topics, that things get, that, that can help them to, to really be motivated, to push forward in life, to push for their goals, to respect others, respect teachers. Don't take teachers or the parents or the even their friends, their siblings for granted. Don't take nothing for granted. The opportunity to be coming to school is a great opportunity. I remember when I was young going to school and some things I even took myself for granted. I took some classes like Spanish or French class for, for granted. Now I grow up, I'm, a, I'm, I'm an international artist. I need French more than anything else. I have to be doing the homework now and rushing up. So I just want to tell them that don't make the same mistakes that uh, many of, our, uh, of us have made because, you know, We've been there, we've been students like themselves, and so we just want to encourage them in their path because we have learned and we've seen where we ourselves have, have made some blunders. So we don't want them to make the same mistakes. So we want to guide them and tell them, don't get caught up with the wrong companies and to choose the real, the right role models and so on, you know, because, you know, sometimes too many great, I see too many great children or, or, or youths just go down the wrong road and go down the drain. We don't want to lose that. We don't such great minds. We don't want them to go, go, go astray and, and and lose it all. You're no stranger to Bermuda. You've been here many times. Should yes, sir. Night at BAA, what pe what can people expect but, from Mike Jano and Lucia? But there's no doubt that we're going to give them a real proper show. And um, as I say, we deal with entertainment. We educate and entertain at the same time. So it's going to be music, lots of great love and great energy. The vibes are bump, right now, pumping up already. What am I going to say about it? Yes, I want to say that, yeah, it's going to be very good tomorrow. It's going to be bouncing. It's going to be bumming. The people are going to feel good. Inshallah. As Lou Shana said, we educate and we entertain. Yeah, yeah that's the whole work, you know? So here we are, and it's glad we're good to be, we feel good to be here. It's like the fifth time now in Bermuda. So, you know, it's a joy. And, you know, the love that we get from the, the Bermudan people has always been great. And we, we want to make sure that when we leave, we leave with a positive message, especially for the youngsters, you know. Tell them not to get too caught up in all this gang war and all this guns and drugs and all this kind of thing. It's not yeah. good. You know, I know Bermuda is a nice place. I've always had a good memory of Bermuda. Clean air, wonderful environment. So we don't want to spoil that. I want to encourage the youth and especially the young, youngsters to stay on the positive path. You know, good music, good vibes, good tradition, you know. You know, His Majesty always says that um, the generation who learns from a, the previous generation is fortunate indeed. So it's very important that we teach the youths that what we have learned and so that they don't have to go through that struggle and that trouble. So it's very important that we give them that message so right now size on that yeah. yeah so we're here to encourage the youths tell them to love themselves love each other love the most high more than anything else and to to be what you say um uh a role model or something. Role mo vessels that the okay. almighty can okay. use okay. you know what i mean yeah. so instrument for instruments of the most high so we're here in bermuda to share that message with the people share it with the youths and you know, just about bring about the general yeah. feeling of love, yeah. you know, and that's what we need. This world and needs it now more than I ever. I honestly believe that the, the, the people out there, they know Bermudians, they know their, their gifts and their, their blessings. But sometimes people need to be reminded. And that's what the message is all about to remind our people to stay focused, stay on track, stay positive, keep it real, keep it clean. See? You you are the master of your destiny yes you can be all you want to be 
Oh well, you are the master of your destiny. Just keep your faith in the Almighty. Rastafari. That's an I as a messenger to teach you youths about roots and culture. Tell them I see the people in Baja. That's all I deal with, I go. Bermuda, this is Luke Jenner's messenger and Mikey General. Coming at you strong. Out of fireball. Yeah, remember.